a townhome. Not many people can do it. Uh, you're one of the very few that can. That's not our destination today, but we'll leave that for uh, some other time. Is this it? What we're looking for today is her well. Felker. Alright. What's up, Felker? Ned be wary. Here in her well, I hear it. Far off screams. Screams men make for dying in a bad way. Grumble. You know, I'll, I'll be honest. I am not the best voice actor. Uh, I do my best. It's not very good. But I <laughs> bear with me here. In the air, something's in the air. It smells off incense or maybe wood smoke. I just change voices. To, you know what? Forget. It. And something that smells like home. It smells like home. Let me save here. Farewell. Nice. Who are you? Danthea, the Penance Redeemer. My, my, a remnant knight. The seven points brings us together in the most ungodly of places. I am Danthea, a redeemer sent by the Church of Lysus. From one hand of justice to another, a warning. Walk lightly upon the cursed ground of her well. Why is it cursed? Danthea says, the Lady of Herwell has ousted a band of great robbers from their holes. Now she's on a cleanse most unholy. But as one of these graves robber I pursue, a man mirrored in sin, much is in need of absolution. I'm going to grant him, if only the Lady will allow me to do my holy work. A remnant knight's authority carries more weight than a hand of the church here in Northern Town, though. You can walk where I cannot. Knight. Help me seek out the sinner so that I may rid myself of this horrid place. Sounds ominous. By her embrace, your spirit rekindled for the task ahead. The grave robber I seek is known simply as the Burned Man. Hmm. Seek out the grave robbers yet to meet the lady's blade and see if you can track down this Burned Man. If you do this, the church will know of its remnant ally and the reward that's deserved. Engulfed in sin. Interesting. Let's try to look out for this burned hand here. Now, one thing that's going on, what you're going to see here, looks like we have here our forge, but I don't believe this is supposed to be here. I think this is only here for uh, my team just to run me through it. But just to show you off what our normal forge can do, we have here, you can forge a weapon. Uh, I had. A lollipop weapon but I'm gonna make something else cuz I, I might I tend to be a little slower so let's let's go with something different here we got the glaive handle stabbing handle one-handed stabbing hmm why don't I you know what I like dual wields I'm gonna pick the dual wield axe head so this is the different heads of the blade I have the mace already. You know what? I'm going to use the mace still. Pommels. The pommels are very special. They give you a variety of different effects. And uh, they, they make your weapon a little bit more unique. Uh, I know for our design of our game, we have, I believe, 30 
uh, different pommels in place and probably more and more will probably be added as we come up with more wild ideas uh, let's see what we have here um, you know what I'm gonna grab blood drinker gain one healing drop every five kills this is gonna help me a little bit later and then the style of the weapon I think the style of the weapon, which one do I want? Your attacks reduce the target's armor by 50% of the damage dealt, stacking up to 25% of their armor. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna do this one. Let's see. We have five more. But loads of money. And make it. Alright. See here. Let's see if I can upgrade. Oh, which one do I want to upgrade? Hmm. I can upgrade this once. Or make this just as useful. I'm, I'm gonna do this. <clears throat> All right. Uh. Okay. I think that's good enough. Got two left. Oh, here we go. Extra runes here, spell rune. I'm gonna put this on to here and put this on here. <gasps> I got two wielding anvils. How do you swing that? Alright, I guess we're gonna go up here. You know what? Lollipop or anvil? Let's go lollipop for now. Let's see what I do. Hello. Oh! Oh! Oh god! Oh no. Oh! That's a lot of damage. Oh! I like this lollipop. Thank you, whoever made this for me. Thank you. I am. Let's try the. Let's try these anvils now. Oh. Oh God. No. 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No. Haste rune. You know what? You know, I'm 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 gonna keep the help for now. So these enemies I'll have a chance to drop some haste runes, some spell gem runes, some just different different runes to kind of beef up your your armor here. So as you can see we already have the help rune in there. Um I have some haste, some penetration rune, some stamina rune, a critical rune. Yeah, I think I think for now I'm gonna I'm gonna keep the help. Let me see where we're at. Oh, hello. Alira, the Lady of Herwell. The woman surveys the cluster of graves before her with a glowing, growing suspicion, as if there were too many of the eternal slabs since she last encountered, or perhaps too few. All around her, quiet weeping of rain falls from nowhere. The patter of droplets against her armor keeps irregular tempo to her anxious mumbling. Where did he find it? Where? 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 He stole it, but I know it will not from where. It can only have come from here, from my home. He will admit I wasn't sure that he reveals. I'm scared. You there, knight. You may have the honored right to walk her Wall Street, but you have no right to the graves. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to touch your graves. Touch nothing, leave the bodies be. But what if they 